Hi guys, welcome back to another video from Casual Gamers Online. Ashley here and happy holidays. Good Friday for everyone today. And I'm going to bring you this video today to show you all what my daily life is like in Maple Story Mobile. Since I've been playing uh, last August till now, it's almost been like 8 months plus. Okay, uh, there's a set of daily a checklist that I do every day. Uh, the first thing that I always do is log into all the characters that I have, all the meals, all the out characters, collect the 120 minute free given by next one. And then fill up the thing to out 360 uh, minute. Then after that, during non-hot time period, I'll run the character itself on different area to farm meso. If you watch my farm best places to farm meso, you'll know which places they are uh, from my previous video. And averagely about a week I can earn about anything from 60 million to 100 million so that's a lot for one account so with two accounts I almost earn about 150 to 200 million per week um, after logging into your main uh, account okay uh, the last one will be logging to my main account so after you log into the main account make sure you collect your rest reward okay rest reward it depends on the level the higher level you are the better the rest reward is and also the attendance reward and also check your events because uh, every now and then next one will give events and if you have events you try to clear the events or collect your events free gift okay so for now uh, my eye sliding mage I have like 10 over me which I haven't do the thing yet I know that the star will only expire maybe 8 days later so I'm taking my own sweet time to do it before I can collect uh, I might cut my this character back to bishop so i'm not collecting the badge and the special gift for this character i just need to collect the seven boss item so that's it the second thing on the daily things that i do will be the daily dungeon and this daily dungeon is important because if you're able to clear the a great jewel make sure you do at least three times a day because after doing three times right you will collect one extra ticket okay or you need to focus the first set of crystal okay because this video is either for beginner or veteran for reference but basically for beginner so if you collect three <coughs> daily dungeon uh, or you clear three times you can collect this extra ticket which you can use for monday saturday and sunday which is the red color jewel that you want to have the red color jewel will act, act on your physical attack or magical attack okay having five s red jewel is awesome but remember always save it like three weeks to a month before you start to fuse it because you fuse it every time you collect the effect uh the chances of you getting s great is super low okay i've tried countless of time usually i save about three weeks to one month and i can get the s great jewel super fast so the the third thing will be expedition okay this is a must too okay every day at least do two times expedition on the 12 p.m or on the 8 p.m why so because you can get this boss drop okay this boss drop itself right will give you a seven set effect look at the seven set effect the physical attack and magical attack is like increased by 200 defense increased by thousand boss attack five percent boss defense critical uh damage critical attack or all having this seven set so seven set is awesome okay uh currently my ice lightning mage is having five sets for almost like 10 days of farming i finally got these five items i got two more things to go the condensed power crystal for the face accessory and also the black bean mark which is the eye accessory and i'll complete seven set at all okay basically all these dailies i do it alone because i hate to wait so i always skip uh the next uh next pyramid okay and for the fourth one that you have to do daily on my checklist will be elite dungeon okay elite dungeon will give you the epic and unique powder this is essential because you upgrade your gear it's needed to upgrade your gear and uh progress you in the game okay it's very precious for this uh, epic and unique powder and at the same time for just now at the birth right the daily dungeon expedition and elite dungeon all give you gold leaf the gold leaf will help you to uh, uh progress it to upgrade your level like from orange gear to uh, green gear or from epic gear to orange gear so definitely you have to collect the fifth one will be this monster carnival that i'll always do because it's insane uh, it's just like 15 minutes into your time five minutes each run okay but i'll give you about 40 to 50 million experience so you can earn like 40 million for losing at this level and 50 million at winning all depends on your level so you give about like 120 million per run and that will save you like in sm80 almost one hour of farming and the six will be the Theon cooking which is this one okay you have to collect the three items uh with the three items that you collect the Theon cooking right uh will give an additional 25 percent 
uh, experience and the items are awesome the today's recipe when you do it three runs right you can collect this level three you get 20 percent crit rate and accuracy to it and this item itself will stack on the how to say will stack, stack on the cash item okay which is awesome because it's additional and it's free you don't have to pay for it so remember to wear your taeon chef hat armor and including your badge when you're doing this taeon quest okay it gives you 25 percent extra buff and the moment when you receive it always lock your taeon equipment okay because if you fuse it away you can never get it back so that's number six number seven will be mulong okay this mulong i always because i'm doing my work i always set to auto and let it clear this mulong points itself will give you free item buff now you check out here the menu all these are like cash buff if you are not a cash buff you are a free to play player okay these items are good and essential so it give you 10 percent buff on crit rate 10 percent on uh, magical attack or magical uh, physical attack all these are free but the most important thing is this 15 percent experience pendant because while we are levering you actually need an extra boost okay bishop will give you 20 percent and this is extra 15 percent if you are all in the in the same party so that's Mulong number seven and number eight let's talk about this evolution the new dungeon okay i don't really hide this new dungeon because this new dungeon spends a lot of time it's like 15 minutes but the experience is pathetic okay if you put a hundred percent experience the experience gives you about like six to eight million and you do you need to have that kind of coin that means the event coin inside this dungeon to have like six to eight million and you spend like 15 minutes and it, it can auto all the way but it takes a lot of time so I'm, i usually unless i'm super free if not i won't do it at all okay so i skip net pyramid uh the pirate and all this and whatnot uh, i'm just doing this eight stuff per day and always save all the buff like the orange uh tickets buff and everything for the number nine item that i'll do the number nine will be the auto battle okay because on weekend they'll give to 20 percent to 40 percent depends on when like sometimes I give up to 40% as uh, party experience, but I'm not sure why this week they are only giving 20%. So basically, on weekends in the morning of 8 a.m. to 12 uh, to 2 p.m., this hot time will be leveling your main. Always level your main on Friday after 12 to 2 a.m. and uh, Saturday and Sunday morning 8 to 2 and at night 7 to 12. This is very important, 7 to 2, 2, 2 a.m. the next morning. This is very important because uh, there's a lot of experience that you can gain from here and it can actually support, support fast speed your, your experience. So these are the nine things uh, I do. So I'm going to just summarize for you. The first thing I always, number one, lock into all characters and collect the auto battle so I can farm meso on the best places in MapleStory Mobile. And then for my main character, I'll check all the events and including collect my rest rewards. The second thing will be daily dungeon, do three times, collect the extra ticket and do it on Monday, Saturday and Sunday. Third one will be expedition, must do because the main aim is to get seven set of boss items. Fourth will be the elite dungeon, get the gold leaf, get the epic unit powder so that you can upgrade your equipment free. Okay, number five with Monster Carnival, insane experience. Do it no matter how busy you are because that will save you a lot of time at SF80. Number six, Taeon Cooking. Okay, get the free items and including experience because one run is about if the items and the level that you are, like my ice lightning mage, you'll be like 22 million per run. So it's like 66 million. Half of Monster Carnival, but it's awesome. Doing this too will give you an insane experience boost the whole entire time. Number seven, Mulong. Get the free stuff. 15% experience necklace because every Monday once you clear Mulong we have a ranking every Monday they'll give you 10 over thousands of Mulong points on every Monday and 8 evolution optional do or don't do up to you number 9 hot time set your character's level on hot time and lastly number 10 which is to do your guild okay so number 10 is do your guild why because our if you have a guild, you will really, really help you a lot. There's so much things to do, including bossing, net, paras, net pyramid run, and all the dailies that they can actually help you to do. So what happens is that uh, the guild will have two functions, okay? Make sure that you sign to your guild to get your guild attendance. And then second, clear the guild dungeon because the guild dungeon will give you three boxes, one red box and two orange boxes. So it's important to do all these uh, steps. So remember to join a guild because guild is very important. It will actually help you to express and level you even faster with all the help from other people. 
And what happens like uh, in this guild dungeon, right? Like just now I mentioned, if you uh, get the orange boxes, remember to claim your rewards. It's like an orange box, uh, two orange box and one red box. These are all the guild items that I get every day. I'm so fortunate to be in Mental Noir because uh, our sign is almost full every day. And you get all these freebies every day. Okay, not the jewel. Okay, the jewel is from a previous quest. So basically, I got a lot of stuff from this uh, guild and I can actually like use the the one to okay let's uh, just take a look at this one uh the orange box will give you uh what uh, if i'm not sh not wrong it should be auto battle oh no the orange tickets the orange box will give you orange ticket like 30 percent 10 percent or 50 percent sometimes okay depending on your ranking in the guild dungeon and these tickets will be super awesome and useful during the weekends why i save it for only weekends because uh take a look at the expiry date if you are able to always save it to the weekend the red box will be the auto weather timer okay these are all the good stuff especially the red box okay this red cube right i can change keep changing until the thing turns purple <laughs> your pot potential from equipment so guys if you're watching this video you are new to Mo uh, maple story mobile i welcome you and uh, take this video as a reference and you're a veteran you've been playing for almost eight months plus since the beginning like me or you've been playing for a long time you have extra input please leave your comments below on any new ideas or any ideas that you want uh, you can input and write on the comments below so that the new players can read about it and then uh, put it into the dailies also that you're doing if you guys got extra thing that you want to add in just feel free to put it in the comments below and please remember to subscribe and click the notification bell I'll try to put out as much as much as possible new content on Maple Story Mobile every time so you won't miss it out. So thank you guys for watching and really really have a super awesome weekend.